it's a fantastic course and um, we've got all of our information in the subject booklet um, available for you to look at but um, what we're going to do now is we're just going to hear from some of the students who are currently studying photography so we've got Maya and Emily and they're both in year 13. So um, the question um, we're going to start with um, is for Maya so why did you choose to study photography Maya? Um, it was something uh, that I was interesting interested in and um, I thought it might also help improve my technical abilities in my other subject media. Nice thank you and Emily? Um, from doing art at GCSE I wanted to carry on my kind of creative interests more but in a kind of different perspective. Mm -hmm. And what what did you find is different from doing art to photography? How was that transition for you? Um, I thought it was quite smooth. It's practically just the same, just without, you know, drawing it. And kind of just kind of um, going more in detail into what you're like photographing. Fantastic. Thank you. Um, so the second question is, what do you enjoy most about A-level photography? So Myra, if you'd like to um, tell us. Um, I enjoy the creativity and the freedom of this creativity, but also... Um, there's a lot of teamwork involved. You kind of bond with the class. So can you give an example of that? Um, for example, when we're doing group stuff, it involves a lot of um, like communication and um, yeah, that's kind of. Fantastic. And um, Emily, do you want to tell us about what you enjoy most? Um, I'd probably say the process. Again, you have that huge amount of freedom and kind of planning and getting right behind the camera. Again, using your friends, helping you with lighting, camera angles and just exploring different ideas. Fantastic. And when you, um, you're sort of saying both of you, in fact, have said that you've got a lot of freedom. And Maya, can you give an example of... Um, your project, do you want to say what you're doing your project about at the moment? Um, my project is all about the individual and um, how society can, um, societal expectations can um, pressure people into being this one person. And I want my project kind of critiques this. And Emily, do you want to say what yours is about? Um, mine's kind of how um, society has kind of developed into this capitalistic movement, whereas like we have no identity and we're just kind of following the same path. Great, thank you. So you, um, if you're watching this, you can see that um, particularly in year 13, there's a lot of um, personal development and in the personal study and um, the students have Obviously, they get a lot of guidance, but they have kind of free reign um, to develop a project which is really um, tapping into their interests. OK, final question. Um, if we can start with Maya, please. What skills have you learned that will help you in the future? Um, I've learned a lot of technical skills, such as looking out for things like angles and composition and lighting and all those that kind of the kind of technical abilities and I think this has helped me with like I said before with my other subject media and do you and um, what's your plan where are you going on to um I plan um to kind of carry on with digital stuff and media and I think photography will has definitely helped me with that Lovely, thank you. Emily, same question. Um, kind of looking at society in a much different perspective and mm -hmm. kind of just, you know, kind of if you have an, an idea in the future of anything you want to do, you can really explore it through photography because you can represent your project in any way that you like. That's brilliant. Well, thank you both very much. Um, we hope that you guys have enjoyed that presentation and um, that you consider choosing photography as one of your A-levels at Cheney School.